Oh my god, I keep pressing that button. Now that we've got that like, Alpha Heracross, I'm going to see if it can learn Rock Smash. And then I'm going to give it over there because, like I said, I wanted Alphas working on the field. Because it just seems funny. So, let me see if Alpha Heracross can learn Rock Smash. It should be able to, right? Wait. Wait. Change moves. <laughs> I knew it. Cool. My Pokemon learnt new moves. Let's go. And now we can finally upgrade the, uh, this place. Oh, yo, you're the guy who's talking about the ponytail, weren't you? You're here about my ponytail, right? Glad to have some help at least. Here's the problem. A ponytail like no one's ever seen before has appeared in the Harston Plains. It looks so different than others, it's a little scary to be honest. When I told the professor, he got all excited about researching it, so he agreed to have the ponytail surveyed and see what's what. If you head there and catch the ponytail for us, it'll really help us out. Catch the strange ponytail in the plains. Yes, yes I shall. Sure would love a Pokemon that Rock Smash. Yeah, I have a Pokemon that has Rock Smash. Here you go. Yep. Whoa, an Alpha? Gee, that's awful kind. Gotta say, it takes an impressive guard to catch an Alpha and give it to folks. Your Pokemon must be a big help in expanding the field. Might as well get started. You have three alphas. Whoa, it provides those pesky boulders. Now I'm all pumped. Sit back. Old Miller's going to make the field bigger than ever. You're going to get all the stuff from this one, she. And I'm done. Yeah. That's some fine work. Any crops we plant now and it's all thanks to you two. We'll keep your Pokemon here to help out with the field work a while longer. Just give us a holler if you want to swap them in with a different Pokemon to do some rock smashing. You can keep the alphas. You can keep them. You okay, have a cross? Liking your new job? Your Pokemon's putting its heart and soul into its farm work. No, no. No, no. Now, there is a particular uh, Pokemon we can go for. Should we go find ourselves a shiny Ponyta? Even though we've already got this guy. And this guy. <laughs> Oh my god, look at Magikarp's picture. <laughs> it looks like he's smiling. <laughs> I'll make an unknown box as well. Just because they're probably rare. My Pokemon are slowly getting stronger by the day. Right, let's go get a shiny, shall we? We'll get the shiny. Then we'll actually continue a bit more of the game. Maybe change up the lock as well while I'm at it. It's somewhere over here. I wonder where it could be. Can you see the shiny ponytail? Point it out for me. <laughs> Imagine if you accidentally killed it. Like you're just wandering around and you accidentally ruin it. Um, missions and requests. No, purely a ponytail. Where is it? Oh, it's a cutscene. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, look at that! Whoa, it's the unusual ponyta. Catch this strange ponyta. I want to put you in the, uh, the feather ball because it seems kind of fun to have a blue ponyta in a blue ball. Sure. Oops. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got you in the back. You're gonna be mine, Ponyta. Yeah, time to take it back to Yoa. Yeah, look at that. Go for you, Ponyta. How fun. That's another shiny to add to our collection. That's what? Uh, one, two, three, four, four, five, four. Four. Because we had the Drift Bloom as well. You want to learn about the Magic Cap? Can you tell me where you're done with it? In your Poggy decks? Oh, this girl's now one of my favorite people in this village. I keep pressing dot. She's now one of my favorite people in the village. She likes the Magic Art. Who knows how many different colored Pokemon are out there in the world? I hope the Survey Corps keeps trying its level best. Its level best? 
to research them all. I mean, my guy, I have multiple shinies at the moment. So you're right, it's not that hard to think about because I have multiple. They're right there. I guess I've just got a lot of bad natured Pokemon because it's normal attacks already going up. Ah, oh, well, it doesn't matter. It's Pokemon. Who cares? As long as it's fun for me, I don't care about the stats. Especially since we can use the uh, the grit stones to kind of negate it. Like, those are just EV training in and of itself. The Covenant Highlands. <laughs> there you are, my girl. Welcome to the Highlands. I expect you'll find all sorts of rocking ground type Pokemon wondering about these craggy boulders. And up there, right belief, the great spiff. <laughs> the great, you know what, fuck it, yeah, the great spiff is the Mount Coronet itself. And the magnetism from it may very well exert some sort of influence on the Pokemon throughout. Fascinating. I'm just going to call the space time rift the great spiff now. Spiff. <laughs> what? Make your way up the mountain. See, you would think that. But I kind of want to do what I usually do and just go explore. So I'm kind of going to go explore. I ain't fighting you, go away. There's a Paris and a Paris set. Yeah, there's a Yammo. I like Yammo. I always like just normal looking Pokemon. Here, have this. That's what I thought. Like, um, what the hell are you? Hi, here, get in the ball. Yam Mega? Huh? Never saw that Pokemon before. Woo! I have now just learnt a really fun use for a Basque Legion. Yam Mega just does not care. I don't think I can get up there. Are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want me to hang out with you. Well, watch what I can do. Wow. <laughs> Layla nerd. I'm going my own way. I don't need to do what you tell me to. I'm just going to leave. I think I could never get into competitive Pokemon. Because... It for well, I wouldn't say it forces me, but it chooses a way to play for certain. Like, oh, I guess I can't go up. Damn! Invisible walls bring me down again because it chooses a way to play. In like, oh, you have to use certain X amount of Pokemon because they're in a meta. Whereas I'd be running in with like a Shedinja. Like, oh, this is kind of funny. It's like, oh, you've got all these different Pokemon. I have shit injured. Ha 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 ha. Look what I've got. Like, you think you scare me? Why did the camera just do that? I want to go up here. Oh, hello. Boom, 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 boom. Open it for me. You'll never take me alive. Wahaha. Nope. Get up. Get up. What? Wow, I cannot go anywhere in this beginning area. Jesus. There's nothing to do. How am I supposed to find this um, salt if I can't go anywhere? Hey, buddy. Come here. Uh, window, Warden Ingo of the Pearl. And oh my, the Galaxy Team bump from before. You're punching well above your weight to see a great electrode. I will punch you down to my size. It would not take long. The sheer tenderness of my heart, I'll grant you a trial to see if you're worthy. The great obstacle. Battle me if you dare. Yeah, sure. I don't want to. We must let my lord frenzy as it made to demonstrate to Almighty Sinnoh that the Diamond Clan lives. 
This may be, dare I say, the very reason I am here on this earth. What business is it of galaxies anyway if Electrode lets loose a few sparks out here in the mountains? Really, you should do us a favour and slink back home to that village of yours rather than pestering this folly. And with that, bon voyage. To meet Sneasel, you must pass through here, the key. You'll find Pokemon like Golbat and their ilk, which are quite at home navigating in the dark. Quite dim inside, you'll need to watch your step. I will go in there in a minute. It is absolutely freezing. There is no new winter gear. So I've gone back to this. You know, you would think I would actually start doing the requests. Because if I do the requests, I get the gear. But I'm an idiot, so. <laughs> like, what is this Zubat one? Speak with Clarissa to learn more about it. Speak with this person. Search their house. Speak with this to do this. You know. <laughs> Like you would think I'd be like, oh, I should get on these requests because it upgrades the place, but maybe I'll do that in my off time because I know they're going to be like 90% talking, 10% actually doing a request. It's like, hi, welcome, I need all of this. Okay, you can go get it, walk out, grab it, come back. Wow, awesome, you did all of this. You know what I mean? Now, I don't want to say it's repetitive, but that's the, odd, that's the unfortunate thing about non- um, non-voiced uh, games. This is odd. The torches are like the way you're gone. Could this be Melly attempting to obstruct us? Either way, there's no need for concern. I know my role. I'll conduct us safely. No darkness, no foul weather will we delay. Onward we roll! Take care not to be... not to come. I don't know what he said. So I guess it's just take care not to come. I recall faintly I had a partner. I'll press this. Is he from a Pokemon game, I'm guessing? Like black and white or something? Oh my god, the giant Alpha Crobat is amazing. Please forgive the unscheduled stop. I detect an Alpha Crobat. Under normal circumstances, I doubt its presence would obstruct someone. But given the poor visibility, I propose a track change in the interest of safety. Please follow me. But I want the Alpha Crobat. There was a man who looked like me. We battle and discuss Pokemon, I think. Yeah, is he from like Black and White, Diamond and Pearl? Because I've not played those games. We'll soon be arriving at the exit. Choo choo! Even if memories themselves have faded, it appears much still lives on in my heart. This is fine progress, we're nearly home free. Wait, could those be? It is, it's the torch. How could she do that to us? Let's put those torches back where they belong. This darkness could be perilous for the next person. Oh, you should have made that a mini quest. If you follow the track map by the torches, you'll reach the cave. No, you should have made that a mini quest. I wanted to go around doing that. You could have had us fight random Pokemon. That would have been cool. Boo. Oops. Oh, look, the Yamma can evolve into Yam Mega. Sure. Whoa! I've never seen that one before. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> Number cart two out of two. Number you've evolved one out of one. Yo. Thank you. Oh, I see you up there, unknown. I see you up there, unknown. Yeah. The fuck? The hell? Hey! You wanna play that game? Stupid unknown. 
finally find one of you, and what do you do? You just kind of be there. Oh, Kazuba. Where'd that alpha go? Hey! There was an alpha here. Is that the Pokemon she wanted? Nope, that's a Wish Flash. Ah, there you are. Hey, give me a minute. Give me a minute and we can fight. Bring it on! <laughs> oh no. Don't kill my little crowbat. Yes. No! They killed my little crowbat. <laughs> Whatever will I do? <laughs> Oh, super effective. Roll out. One minute. I'll go for a bishop so you can use ice, ice punch. Yeah, you want to play that game? Well, that wasn't that good. Oh, come on. She's getting two attacks. This is cheating. Uh, well, I do have the Yam Megas to help me out as well. That's kind of fun. Kind of glad I caught them now. You, ancient power. There we go. Good job, Yam Mega. Oh my god. You know what? If I can't catch you, you will become XP. Get it. That's what you get. That's what you get. You should have just been my Pokemon and you would have been fine. But no. No, you wanted to fight me. That's a gibble. But it didn't really leap out at me. I was stood here. I kind of feel so sorry for you, gibble. <laughs> It could have been XP. It could have been fine. I could have had that Pokemon hang out with me and I had a giant bloody Crobat. But no, it wanted to fight. It wanted to show it was strong. And now where is it? It's gone. The hell was that noise? The hell are you looking at? Oh. <laughs> Anything in here? No, I can say this though. This cave's good for collecting random items. What was that then? That an unknown? Oh no, it's just bad graphics. Right, it, it wasn't an unknown. It was just bad graphics. Got it. Aha, I caught your friend. Haha, <laughs> caught you, friend. <laughs> Damn, these are, these Pokemon are starting to uh, starting to get a little a little bit stronger than uh, than, uh, than I like. Like they're all in the level forties. I've barely just made it to level forty. Professor Lavinson told me how you fell to this land from the sky. For my part, I simply find myself one day here in Hisui, a region whose name I'd never heard. All I could remember was my own name. I was still standing there in bafflement when a Poe clan came to my aid. I showed a natural affinity for taming Pokemon, which is why I eventually became a warden. But I still wonder what my true purpose is here. But now I've sidetracked us with this talk. Let's hurry onward. Make your way up the mountain. Oh look, it's a tiny Heracross. <laughs> I caught the giant version of you. It now works on a field helping me out. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's just plants. This is a really good looking game. Go duck! Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Yeah, you will run away. Oh, he ran to go get his friend's help. <laughs> Can't lie, that's actually kind of adorable. Like, oh no, someone's here to attack me. Better run away and get my friends. 
No, I don't need any of you. I'm going to go this way. What are you looking at? <laughs> Stay in the ball. Oh, damn it. I need, like, an electric type or something. What's in here, I wonder? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a hammer boss. Mystic fire! Harris, did you really want to get involved in this? Yes, you did! Mystic fire! Bye bye, Paris. Yeah, the only time I've heard our character talk is when she's just lobbing Pokeballs. No, I was facing my satchel. I need to find a base then. Hey! I wasn't trying to fight you. No, I don't want to go there. I need a base. Something to do. Base to put my items. Ah, oh, forget it. Fight me! What's the big idea putting back all those torches I spent ages tidying away? You got some amusement stomping around and ruining people's noble deeds? Mending the cave impossible to people who venture inside hardly seems noble to me. Yeah! <laughs> but that just goes to show that even we wardens don't always see eye to eye. I extinguish those lights for the sake of the Pokemon in the cave who prefer the dark but now you lights have put my efforts to shame if you think i'll let you saunter ahead to lord electrode you're solely mistaken the only way you're getting past me is if you defeat my partner pokemon uh i don't want to fight i need to heal my pokemon are you certain it seems like i'm only i don't want to fight i can you heal my pokemon then scun tank Show these people what for. Can you heal my Pokemon? No, that's what I thought. No, I just beat up. Mystic Fire! Don't you dare. No, oh, we dead. Coming out, Bishop. I'm gonna make you punch a skull tank. <laughs> punch it. Nice. Oh no, it punches back. Punch it again. There we go. Right, Ingo, are you gonna heal my Pokemon for me, please? Woo! 43! 37! Listen here, neither I nor Skun Tank admit defeat just yet. Our challenge to you still stands. However, I will withdraw to afford Skunk Tank time to recover. There's no shame in a tactical retreat. It's more of an advance if you think about it. Keep you gagged up. We'll be back. All right, discount James, go away. What a lively character. Yeah. I cannot fathom Warden Melly's intentions, but for now, let us press on. Oh, healed up and ready to go, baby. Let's go back. A lock of wisp. A sense of earth. Whoa, that was a cool transition. And then after anything, just boop, boop. Oh. Boop. <laughs> there we go. I have seen that moth Pokemon multiple times now. I'm not going for that wisp down there because it means I have to run all the way back up. Multiple times now as an alpha. That thing. Like we, we've seen it multiple times this episode. Oh, hello. I saw something in there. This is the ancient quarry. The stones used to build a temple atop this mountain were all cut from this place. Whether by humans and Pokemon working at once or by labor of Pokemon, I cannot say. The stones were left behind should serve to cover us from the gazes of wild Pokemon. There you are, Ingo. Hey, it's you. Hello. Bolo, what is the matter, sir? I wanted to ask you about that memory loss. Have you considered that it could be somehow caused by the space-time rift? 
I have no idea to think the rift is to blame, but then again, I hardly remember a thing, so it's difficult to say with certainty. I can't remember my own home, nor my family, if I had any. So you might do better to pose your question to Stubbs, I think, if it's to do with that rift. Indeed, well I do hope your memories return, Warden Ingo. How about you, Len? Do you remember what you saw before you fell out left rift? Was there anything inside? Nothing. Until next time. Bye. What a strange person. Once we're through here, it'll be a little further. Let's move with speed, but not haste. Sure. Make your way up the mountain. Stunk. Hi. Oh god. Steady. Steady. Let's go. One's all. Oh, steady. What the fuck? One zong! Oh, go away, you're just jealous I didn't try catching you. Fight your friends, low, now live on your own. Away! <laughs> These feather balls are great. It's kind of one little love tap of a ball in your pot. Persevering! Hi! Don't worry, I'm not after you. I'm gonna steal your child! Wah! Oh god. Oh, come on, this stupid heavy ball, man. I would use a great ball instead, then. Almost killed me just for a bloody finger. Oh, come on. I've got something to do to get this camp set up. Oh, look, it's you. Hi. Oh, no, it's not you. You just kind of look like me. You're part of the galaxy team. I've been waiting. I came here since I heard you were all playing the camp. Yes. But it seems not much progress has been made since that bronzo is getting in the way. It seems like it wants something. We can't ignore it either. Please, you think you could find out what it wants? Maybe it wants a friend. Yes, I want that. Hello, little dude. Hi. Zor. Oh, do you want to get across? There's something over that way? Are you sure? Oop. They want this. Oh, it's its friend. It's stuck by the gold box, got you. Well, in that case, I'll just do what I've been doing before. Fire! Fire! Look how easy that was. Hey, little buddy! So. 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 I saw Bronzo go flying off in this direction all of a sudden. Whoa, it's wounded. Oh, here, I'll fix it right up. That should do it. Bronzo should be as fit as a fiddle now. Zor! <laughs> Zor -zo. Seems like the Bronzo at the new campsite were looking for its friend the whole time. I'm glad you looked into it, otherwise we may have been too late. This land is dangerous, even for the Pokemon that call it home. It may be wise to, play, to be extra prepared as we explore this area. I'll be sure to keep a fine line up of wares stocked for you, so please buy anything you need. Ah, it seems the base camp has all been set up while we were talking, in which case I should get settled in as well. So long. Well, that was easy. I just kind of jumped over and got a new base. And I got two gold ducks out of it. Real easy. Which means that I can also store my um, random stuff I've got. This music's awesome. Listen to it. Oh, I'm the guy at the general store. Don't mind me. Wait, what? Oh, these are little bronzers! Hey, buddies! Yeah, one minute, I've got something for you! Give me a sec, give me a sec, give me a sec! Yeah, look at 
Why are you not friends? Oh, look, they reacted to it as well. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you want to see? Do you want to see the big guy? There you go. Yeah. <laughs> I'll put them away now. Don't mind me. I want to see my Pokemon and put them away. Move and go there. See ya. Hi, Bonzo and everyone. Hope you guys do okay. Now, what was over here? I saw a side. It's upside up. What's up, random thing? What's up, alpha version of the random thing? Hey, have this. <laughs> Did I just catch an alpha by it? <laughs> I got a level 52. Hey. Hi. <laughs> what a big dude. <laughs> well, well, that was easy compared to the other alphas of thought. <laughs> Yay! Easy alpha! Let's go! <laughs> well, I, oh, I can get up there. Oh, I can probably get up there. Come on, let me see if I can scam him away up. Here, 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 here. Oh, come on. Wait, nearly. If you go to about here. Oh, that's awful. Oh, well. All right, time to move on. Ready up. <laughs> I can't believe I caught that alpha so easily. Just kind of walked up, went, here you go, how do you do? And then suddenly alpha. Hey, you can break that, Mr. Alpha. And before we talk to you, my dude. Oh, look at Bronzo. Yeah, I get it, you don't like me. Think, think. Oh, there's the alpha of it. Can I do it again and possibly get a second alpha with ease? I wonder if the feather ball can reach. Fire! Oh, come on with these stupid boxes, man. These hitboxes are goddamn awful. Look, what is that? We got it. I'm trying to stay hidden and catch a Pokemon. It's just not working. Oh! You would never expect to be able to climb such a sheer cliff that sneeze, yes? But with Sneeze Love as an ally, it becomes the work of a moment. She is so at home on a cliff face, one might think she knew some secret, some hidden move. What am I saying? Hidden moves? There's no such things in history, surely. Yet I feel as though I was on the cusp of remembering something just now. Just who I was before I came to Hisui. If you fell from the sky, you come from another world altogether, most likely. Perhaps a Pokemon battle with you would jog this memory loose. Would you honour me with a battle, Stubbs? Alright. I want to help my little amnesiac friend. All aboard! Machoke, prepare for departure! Uh, Mystic Fire! Nice. It's a good thing you notice I was on mute for like 20 seconds because Jesus Christ, imagine if I was on mute for longer. Ooh, that's a cool looking Pokemon. Good job, King. Hit with a Mystic Fire again. Haha. <laughs> no! Oh, I became obscured. Let's try Infernal Parade. 
Oh, it's obscured. Good job, King. Let's try it again, Infernal Parade. Oh, that's a really cool looking move. And lastly, a little tango. Hey! That's what I get for mocking. Ah, but this does double damage now that I'm hurt. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Hurt again, Infernal Parade. Good job, King. That's why you have that name. Bravo. Excellent. I like Ingo. Yeah, level up. Level up, level up, level up now. The talent has brought you to the destination called Victory. Now allow me to call Sneasler. That's just a dude in a fursuit. Allow me to introduce you, Stubbs. This keen clawed Pokemon is Sneasler. Would you be so kind as to play your flute for her to hear? Okay, that's just a girl in this fursuit then. Now that is just that is just straight up a person. Like, yeah, they're a little taller than us, but that's just straight up a person in a suit. And now she's mocking me. It opened her, she opened her heart to the sound of your playing. Here's a psychic plate. Oh, toxic plate. Yay. I'm afraid this is my final stop. Please proceed up the cliff with Sneasler's aid and quell the Lord up in the mountains. I will return to Jubilife Village. Please convey my well wishes to Warden Melly. Now then, all aboard! You can now call Sneasler to scale and descend sheer cliffs. You can climb them up to summon them, press A when you're near a cliff. So like this? Oh my god. That's actually really quick. <laughs> look at you! <laughs> look at the eyes. Well, I guess this is how we get all these items. Can she do anything else? Or what's up? <laughs> hey, I'm one of you, fellow. How do you do, fellow Pokemon? Whoa, why the hostility? <laughs> I'm one of you. <laughs> Listen to them just clink, clink, clinking away. Oh, I can sneak up on you. Get in the heavy ball. God damn you. That's what I thought. See, one tiny insult and you get in. This is seriously just a person. Number of heavy species you caught. It's an alpha. It better be a heavy, heavy species. What are you on about? Hey, look at that. We can go down there. Hello! Oh god. Woo! <laughs> Cliff diving! There's, there's, there's just, there's just a person here. What's up? Dumplings! Okay. I trust someone like you will be able to make a truly choice dish. Farewell, my friend. I have no idea who you are. But cheers, I guess. Look at that Graveler just vibing. Good for you, Graveler. Good for you. Just chill out and relax. You deserve it, King. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Gibble! You're not a shiny, I've seen you before. Maybe I should heal my Pokemon before I do this. Uh, oh, you want to laugh at me? You're coming home with me. Go asleep, please. Get in the ball. Just get in the ball. That's all you need to do. Hey. <laughs> Speaking of alphas. 
Speaking of alphas, hang on a minute. I see you down there. Stealthy. Stealthy. Fire! Damn. It's not seeing me yet. Surprise! All right, fine. You're getting in the Pokeball off. <laughs> oh my god, 77. Maybe not. It's, maybe it's not getting in the Pokeball. Especially when it can do that to another Alpha. Yeah, uh, no. I decided to battle another time. That is totally my choice and not the fact that it's level 77. Because I choose to not do that fight. That fight was not worth it to me. It did. <laughs> clink, clink. I like Bronzo. What the hell are you? Why are you? Hi. You want to come home with me? Yeah? No? Oh, God. <laughs> you missed. Oh, look at the tiny Gyarados. Look how small it is. <laughs> I've really got to stop accidentally putting the uh, thingy off. Oh my god, all these Pokemon are so aggressive. Oh my god, it's a Cypher. What's down here? Woohoo! How do you do, fellow Magikarp? Where on earth am I? Oh, I'm over here. I don't think I'm near a base or anything. <laughs> Just a load of ravelers. Half my Pokemon are fainted, the other half are alphas. Some of them I don't want to use because they're too high level. Well, I say that, but they're not. But They're not keeping up with my main Pokemon, that's the thing. So using them feels a bit like cheating. Oh, it's Roselia. Hey, little one. You're coming home with me. Stay in the ball. Oh. Oh, no. A tiny flower's going to attack. I'll steal this one instead, then. See? <laughs> Didn't mean that, but cool. God, you really can just travel across the land, can't you? I have been running God knows where, but I have no idea where I'm at. You cannot go any further. Um, pretty sure I can, because I'm doing it right now. Oh, it's down here. Cool. Right, well, let me go heal my Pokemon then. Ow! Wow! Oh, God! Well, I guess we better move on. I fell. I lost. Which was upsetting. And this is why I'm always, and I say always, because 99% of the time I am, constantly making sure that the stuff I pick up goes in a bloody box. Because of I me doing dumb shit, which ends up with me losing the uh, the items I had. Is that an Alpha Chimeco? Oh no, it's just a Chimeco. <laughs> I was gonna say, look how small it is for an Alpha. Speedy little thing. What's up? Fine. Mainly because I just want to get some XP. I want to see how strong you are. I'm not going to use the Alpha Gabite I picked up either because it's 56 and like I said a moment ago, it kind of feels like cheating if I use Pokemon way out of my level. What level were you? Like five? I don't know. 
Yeah, fight this. Oh no, a graveler! Yeah, so I am roughly around the right level for this place. <laughs> I draw pumps just destroy you. Right on, don't tempt it. I have a water Pokemon, my guy. Oh, look, it's. Oh, look, it's a parent with its babies. Look, it's another parent with its babies. They're just doing their own thing, being a family and whatnot. I can't separate them. Even if it would be really funny. Now, where. Oh, well, this is where I fell off, wasn't it? Can I feed you food? Maybe if I actually grab something. Hey, Magikarp! Magikarp! There you go, buddy! That's for you! Alright, up this mountain we go. Oh, is that the salt I need? Yes, it is! I need three of these bad boys to upgrade the shop again. I've got... Oh my god, look at that bloody alpha golem. Dude, I am not trying to be your enemy. I'm trying to just get past you. Thank you. I just wanted chunky soul. I'll keep collecting it since, <laughs> since I can. Chunk oh, crunchy salt, not chunky salt. Now that I think about it, chunky salt would be disgusting. Ew. Just a big blob of salt. God. Peace. Ew. That's actually really disgusting thinking about it now. Just imagine biting into it like a sugar cube, but it's salt. <laughs> crunch, 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 crunch. Milom. Right, so that's clearly the way to go. But I want to see what's up here. Ha 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 ha. Into the ice zone. Hey, that's your buzz. Of course he's going to be angry. Wait, is that an elected? And whatever you are? Are you seriously not noticing me? Really? He <laughs> noticed now. <laughs> Yo dude, just don't mind me going past. That's the stone portal. I've been told to not let anyone pass. You know, I could just... I hate this game. Oh, you're gonna fight me in my scum tank again. I know I'm not exactly being supportive of you reaching this place, but a part of me did hope you'd make it. Call me contradictory all you like, Galaxy Grump, but such is life. Embracing the complexity of both ourselves and the world can only help us grow. As a member of the Diamond Clan, my highest calling is to please the almighty Sino. And right now, that means I must protect my law by stopping you where you stand. If you still wish to defeat me, you and your little Pokemon better give it its best shot. Let's go, Gun Tank. Give him another whiff of your silent deadliness. I'm going to destroy you. Completely. Go, Bishop. Yeah. Oh, you brought out three Pokemon, that's not fair. Really? Level 22? Never mind. Punch it. That'll be funny. <laughs> no, not punch me. Punch your Pokemon. I'm going to punch you and I'm going to switch out. Oh, dare you. Bishop, punch him. Uh, punch her. Bishop, no! Mystical Fire King Gallum! Nice. The battle has been decided! Yay! Just say you fancy him and get it over with. Yes, yes, I know what comes next. You want to know what pleases Lord Electrode so you can make some bombs? Well, I'm afraid I won't be able to help you, but I do not know. I guess it's my fault for not telling you in advance. 
What Electra like. So here it is. Adam! What now? I could hear you just now, you know. Are you really going to tell this little noodle what she needs to find just like that? I have beaten you multiple times. Lest we all forget, you're the leader of the diamond. Why would you bother with these galaxy louts? Use your eyes, Melly. Haven't you even looked at your frenzied lord? Don't you feel even a twinge at how it suffers? Fighting to control the energy that's bursting out of it. I can't write off these frenzies as some trial from almighty Sinnoh. That's why I'm doing the best I can to help out Stubbs. This is bigger than what team or what clan we belong to. Oh, and by the way, I wasn't going to tell her that she needs punchy salt. I was going to go right ahead and give it to her. Nice. There, I made you practically infinite supply of bombs, so chuck them, at, or, <laughs> chuck them at Electrode all you like. But don't underestimate my lord's strength. I fairly much doubt the likes of you can quell it. Well, I'm going to do it. Just watch me. So even knowing you're doomed to fail, you still wish to pit yourself against the Electrode? Yes, I do. I'm ready for battle. You've got a great deal more pluck than you have sense. I'll give you that. Word of advice. Don't stop moving while you're battling him or you'll be dead in no time. We've just sent a kid to die. Nice tree. Oh, so that's what Vault Tool blocks like here. <laughs> Does that mean that they purposely evolve? Even the Electro. Does that mean they purposely evolve with our Pokeballs change? <laughs> Lord of the Hollow. <laughs> I wonder, so if you go to the future, not where we come from, the future future, if you go to them, would, um... Oh my god, he's just sacrificing all these little false orbs. Um... Oh my god. Oh, come on now, two. Ow! Ow! Damn, this is a lot more difficult than I thought it would be. Yeah, and there's nothing I can do for them either. Oh! Oh, he's chasing me! I don't think he would. <laughs> it's gonna blow! Sending the Pokemon to do battle. Go! Oh, I was lucky. Here's your chance. Show Electrode your power. No, don't you use Thunder Wave, are you? Piece of crap. Alright, quick mystical fire. Super effective. Let's go. Alright, bees it in one. Come on. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. No, just tank the damage! Tank the damage! I did it! <laughs> oh yeah! Hey, shut out. Was it? You got the electric plate. Close enough. Just gonna roll on out of here. Bye. Oh, for shame, what utter calamity. Did you not see he was smiling? I agreed to make those accursed bombs, yes, but now the almighty Sinnoh's precious blessing is vanished forever. It's just so unbelievably sad. Is that how you see it? Electrode looked relieved to me, glad it's suffering ended, probably. Oh come on, seriously? That's just your wishful thinking, nothing more. All your preaching doesn't ruffle me one bit, but if our mighty Sinnoh grows angry with me because of this, I don't know what I'll do. I arrived right on schedule. I like Ingo. <laughs> now what did you bother coming back for? Only to say that I record some things after subs did me the honour of travelling with me. Things to do with a world where I believed I'd lived before my memories were lost. Most people there caught Pokemon, lived with them, 
from supportive partnerships with them. And then, there were Pokemon trainers. The ones we called Pokemon trainers were truly devoted to their craft. They always looked towards the next challenge and had Pokemon battles every chance they got, or to help themselves and their Pokemon grow. Through battles, trainers forged bonds of understanding with their Pokemon, and with their opponents, and their Pokemon too. With everything, I suppose. I wonder if Almighty Sinnoh will be pleased once I've achieved exactly that. Now this time I really will make the complete return trip to Jubilife. Perhaps with someone like Stubbs to show that Pokemon need not be feared, the people of Hisui will find new tracks forward. Now, begging your pardon, I owe Commander Kamado my report. Until next time, Stubbs.